Well, hey everybody, welcome once again. You know, we do a lot of tool. Every now and then, you want to do some projects to your old car. You don't have a lot of money. Well, there's a lot of things you can do that don't cost you anything. So today, I thought I'd bring you over here and show you what I've been doing to the, to the Chevelle. Uh, don't cost anything, just looks better, makes me feel better. So I hope you enjoy it. Let's start under the hood where uh, I've been doing some little things. Uh, yesterday we got out of here and replaced the fittings on the gas line. The uh, filter was stopped up, wasn't stopped up, but it was dirty. So I found these AN fittings and uh, put them on there. Just thought they'd look better. There again, another project didn't cost anything. Back over here. There was a, down below this bracket, there was a, a voltage regulator left over from the time that was a, a generator system on this car. Since then, it's uh, gone to an alternator. So we didn't need it, so I took it out and uh, painted that area up, made it look better. Again, didn't cost anything. Oh, one more thing. I broke out the mother's polish and got on this radiator. I've been shining on this radiator now for a couple of years. And just every now and then I'll rub it down and it just gets brighter and brighter. I think it looks pretty good. Well, you can see the uh, steering wheel fell off. Or I more like took it off. Uh, I'm tempted to uh, repair the horn. It doesn't work on this car. So, uh, so unsuccessful so far getting the horn to work, but you know, I'm still digging on. Printed me a uh, diagram off of the uh, internet so everything go back together like it's supposed to be. And uh, I'll bring you over here to show them, paint up the column, make it look real good. And that's the rest of this little car is. Another little project doesn't cost a thing. Here's our column. Uh, been sanding on it, and uh, this piece goes right here. We'll paint it up, put it back on. Hope it look better. Got some gloss black. Got some uh, 400 grit paper. That's to finish the paint job off with. And some primer. So we're all set. Always got to have your mental spirits clean up with, so let's get to work on this thing so it looks like. Take two. Requires some more work than that, and I can feel it. say that uh, prep is 99% of, I think 99%, whatever, it's more important than the actual paint job. So remember that. Prep it good. Get all the high places out. Run your finger over, see if you feel a little ridge. It is, sand a little more on it. You'll get it. back to it. Wipe her down with your mineral spirits after the sanding. Then we'll put in a coat of primer and 
See what that looks like. Newspaper down. And get the old rattle kit out. Gonna let this dry, give it a look, see what we think. I already see a few spots I need to work on. Well, welcome back. While uh, I was priming the uh, column and getting it all finished, you were getting your battery charged. So, welcome back. We're ready to put some color on this thing now. Let me show you a little trick I've done though. See this fan clamp right here? It's uh, used to hold the tachometer on the column here. Slides down over that. That's the way about everybody puts a tachometer on the column. If you know a better way, please tell me about it. But anyway, always scratches up my column, so I thought, hmm. I'll take some painter's tape, line around the inside, trim it out, stop that scraping. So let's throw some color. Well, second coat's complete, so all we've got to do now is wait for it to dry to touch. That's always been my problem. Too big a hurry, you know? Take your time. Ain't going nowhere. Car certainly ain't going nowhere with this part, that's for sure. Anyway, we'll get back to it. Well, the columns are dry. Let's go put them back on.
been a few minutes since uh, <laughs> I've done this, so we are now getting close to capping this thing up. Always goes better on the TV, you know that. You ever notice? Now I gotta figure this out. Well, if I didn't get the horn work, at least I got the the column shiny and looking good, not scratched up anymore. And uh, I guess that'll be doing it to next time we get something going on this whole thing. There another cheap project. We'll see you later.